hello everyone and welcome back to my channel Linda's Creative Boutique Happy New Year to all of you um, it has been a minute since I have been on um, making YouTube videos and simply because I've had a lot of things going on um, with my business and just family things and whatever so it has been a minute since I have been on but I am so happy to be back here with you all to share um, some items that I found at Hobby Lobby during the 75 and 90 percent off sale I know the 90 percent off items and the 75 percent off items are probably mostly gone if not gone but um, I'm a little late to the game with sharing but I just want to show you some of the things that I found um, that you might be able to still find at some of your stores. I'm not really sure, but I just want to share this with you all. I hope you are having a great new year so far. And, um, because I have a lot to share, I'm not going to, um, prolong this introduction. I'm going to go ahead and just jump right in and show you what I have purchased. Um, I have Joann's, Michael's, and Hobby Lobby. So I'm going to start with, oh, and I have a few things from Dollar Tree that I recently picked up. So I'm going to go ahead and um, start with those, item, those items since I didn't purchase a whole lot from them. I'll go ahead and share these with you all. Okay, so I'm going to start first with Michael's. And Michael's, I happened to go in, I think it was about a week ago, and um, they had their beads on sale. And so I picked these up. These are um, glass beads. And let me see what's on the back. Um, it says red 14 millimeter faceted glass beads. And so I picked up two of those. And um, also when I went to Michael's, I had a $5 voucher, so I used my voucher as well with these items, but um, these right here, they rang up for like $2.65, they were regularly $6.99 a piece, but I got them for $2.65, and um, those are the only things I'm probably just going to tell you the price because I don't want this to be really long. Um, however, when I got to the register, they had these stickers right here in a bin where um, all of these were 99 cents. So I picked up the black ones, I picked up the silver, and I picked up the gold. And um, I was kind of skeptical at first. I was like, I wonder if these are really 99 cents or did somebody just drop them in there at the register. But when I got up there, they did ring up for 99 cents. They also had their Christmas um, items 75% off. So I picked up these stickers because I'm always needing stickers. Um, and y'all, I wasn't even like conscious of I had that bag rattling, but <laughs> I'm sorry if that was annoying while I was talking. Um, but I did pick up these stickers um, for my gifts because I'm always needing stickers. The ones that I have, I had for a long time. And when I tried to use them, um, this past Christmas, some of them, they didn't stick well. The sticky wasn't good on them because I'd had them for so long. And I keep my Christmas, um, decorations and paper and stuff like that in my garage. So I know with it getting hot and then cold, you know, that can affect the stickiness. So anyway, I just picked up another one of those. And then I picked up these beautiful cards, these, um, little, um, well, they, they say they're tags, but to me they look like little cards. But they have the little sticker on the back. And it looks like you can open them up and write inside of them. Um, let's just look at one right quick. Yeah. And so, you know, they're like little cards to me. But they're tags, I guess. I guess you could use them either way. But I picked up... Um, I picked up a pack of those um, and those were like really expensive I think they were like I paid like 75 cents for each of these okay I also picked up these um, that's just one of their little coupons they give you these um, muslin bags in red 
Um, they're by Bead Landing, and this is a five piece. And I just picked these up. They were five ninety nine, I believe. And then, um, you know, with my um, my voucher, my voucher was five dollars. So I'm thinking, you know, I pay like ninety nine cent for these. So I went ahead and just picked those up um, to use in my event that I have coming up. Okay, and that's all that I that I got from. Michaels and I'm just looking around to make sure yeah this is all I picked up from Michaels so I'm going to put this back up and then I'm going to go on to uh, I guess I'll go on to Dollar Tree now these things I picked up this past weekend and um, I picked this little gnome up I thought it was really cute I saw, um, oh God, what's her name? Her name is Jenny. I can't remember her, her YouTube channel right now, but, um, but she had picked up one similar to this and she altered it and, um, it turned out really cute. She made it, she gave it like a rustic look and I thought it was really cute. So I was just trying to think of how I can alter this one, um, the bottom part and then the hat. Um, but it's just something I got to play around with. Nothing specific. And then I picked up these just because I thought they were cute. <laughs> and um, there's a little donut. And then there's a cupcake. And I got them because they didn't necessarily look like Valentine's. And it's just something I got to just sit around here in my craft room. Just for something cute. I also picked up these lips right here. I thought they were really cute. And I can use these. Um, you know on projects and I think Hobby Lobby has has these I think but they're like $3.99 and then 40% off so I thought um, you know $1.25 wasn't bad on that and then I picked up um, four of these little um, bathtub glitter bathtub fizzies um, it says glitter glitter bathtub fizzer trio and I picked up three of these um, just for some little things that I want to do. So that's all I got from Dollar Tree. Um, next I have Joanne. And Joanne, I didn't really get that much from Joanne. I also had a voucher from Joanne. So I just picked up a couple of things here. I think I had like $10, I believe. But I picked up this... Um, park lane black um, car stop and I like it because it has the solid core so like when you cut it it's not going to have that white showing um, you know it'll it's black all the way through so that's one reason I picked that up because the the car stop that I normally get from Hobby Lobby it has the white core so when you cut it you know you have that white showing and you have to get like a marker or something and cover that up but that's the reason I picked that up I also picked up some um, strong heat resistant tape, the Cricut tape. Um, I have some, but I have never tried the strong heat resistant tape. So I picked that up. And um, they had all of the Cricut um, items. Let me see. Do I have my receipt up here? I don't have my receipt. But they had all of their Cricut items. Um, I think they were 25% off. It was 25 or 30%. I can't really remember, but I did get them on sale. And then I picked up two of these um, infusible ink um, coffee mugs because in my business I do, I'm doing infusible ink, I do the coffee mugs and I do the tumblers right now. And I'm getting ready to also do some other things, but I have a craft fair coming up in May, so I wanted to... Um, go ahead and get some supplies and some things that I can go ahead and create some items that I can um, sell at my craft fair. So that's why I picked these items up. And like I said, all this stuff was on sale. So I think I only paid like $4 and some change for these. Um, and then the tape, um, it probably was 3 or $4. And then um, the paper was on sale as well. So I picked that up. Um, Okay, that's it. Now I'm going to get ready to jump into Hobby Lobby. And so one of the things I have here on my desk, because I've already kind of um, looked at it, is this book right here. And I don't think I shared this with you all, but 
Um, I picked this book up. It's um, Jewelry School, Let's Start Beating. And um, I, you know, do some jewelry making and I have started, well, I make earrings, but I wanted to get into some other types of jewelry making. So I picked up this book on clearance for $3.23 at Hobby Lobby. It was regular $12.99. So I got that up and I've already kind of gone through it and looked at some things that I would like to try. So I picked that up from Hobby Lobby. I also picked up, um, now this stuff right here, I just got this past weekend. Um, they had all of their Master Touch canvases on sale, so I picked up these. I had never seen these before, but I went to a different Hobby Lobby that's further away from me. It's probably like 30 minutes out with no traffic. Um, and I picked these up because these were 40% off. So I picked up the Magnetic Canvas Hearts and they were $5.99 with 40% off. I picked up um, the Magnetic Canvas Squares, um, same price. And these are all three pack. You get three in a pack. And then I also picked up the Circles. And um, I picked these up because I want to try to create some things that I can sell in my craft fair. So I picked those up. Um, and I also picked up these straws. It was just something random. They were... A dollar so I just picked them up um, wait this says 99 cent hey wait and reduced to a dollar I just noticed that okay that's not a reduction actually that's a penny more but um, and then it looks like some are missing you know I may take those back because that's not right yeah I'm gonna put those to the side those are going back okay and then I picked up some of the metallic threads and these were 99 cents when I went. They were 99 cents. And um, they're regularly, um, some of them are $2.99 and some are $3.49. I think these right here, let me see. Okay, all of these are $2.99. It looks like the only one that was $3.49 was this one, the silver and the black. Um, so these are by Soology, and so yeah, they were three ninety nine a piece, two ninety nine a piece, except for this one was three forty nine. But I got them all for ninety nine cents. And you know, metallic threads, we can use them. You know, we can use them in our projects. So I thought these were some nice colors to have. And so I got that from Hobby Lobby. Okay. And then let me get my receipt because those straws are going back. I didn't even notice that when I picked them up. I just saw a dollar on them. And then it's supposed to be 25. And this is not 25. This is 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12. Four. It's 15 in here. So 10 of them are missing. No, that's going back. Okay. Um, let me share one thing with you all. I went to Target to pick up some personal things and um, I just wanted to show you all this one um, candy dish that I got. It looks like the little um, candy, like the the dispenser, um, like what they have at like fairs and stuff or like if you go into a restaurant they have the little grab thing that comes down and grab like you can get the stuffed animals or whatnot. Um, and I thought this was really cute. This was $5. And so I used these in my craft room to store things in. Um, but I thought this one was really cute. I picked it up, um, like I said, from Target. And it was $5. So I just wanted to share that with you all because I had it here on my desk. Okay, back to um, Hobby Lobby. Okay, I picked these up. And I already have a lot of these that I picked up previously from Hobby Lobby. Um, during Christmas, I picked them up. They were... Mm, I think 40 no I think they were 40% off I can't remember um, but anyway I had picked a lot of them up so I picked up two more because this is something else um, that I want to um, I have an idea in mind that I want to try um, to do then I picked up um, now these items I got when everything was 75% off okay so I picked these up. These were $6.99 and they're the sand ornament bulbs, but I had another idea of something that I would like to use them for. So I picked up, um, let's see, 
and I'm glad I went ahead and got them because I was going to wait until they went to 90% but I was like no let me go ahead and get them because they only had like five bags hanging when I went so I went ahead and picked up uh let's see how many did I get three I think I got three yeah i think that's all i got so i went ahead and picked up three while they were 75 percent up and i'm glad i did because by the time i went back for the 90 percent, they were gone like none of them were there so i got those for 90 percent off i mean uh 75 percent off okay i also picked up at 75 percent off these ornament frames frame ornaments um and i got these just some stuff i got because um this year I want to do more handmade gifts and this past year I did handmade handmade gifts that I gave to my family so I just got these because I just you know just wanted to have them in case um, I had an idea and I wanted to do something handmade for Christmas so I picked up um, two of those and those were at the 75% off I also picked up these little snowmen because I thought they were cute um, and I got these for, you know, to use this coming year as well. I also picked these up. I got these when they were, was it 90%? I may have gotten these at the 90%, which means I only paid 49 cents for them. Um, I can't remember, y'all. <laughs> it was either 90 or 75%. I also got these little buttons right here. They look like little cookie cutters. And I thought those were cute. And then I picked I picked up two of those. And they were $2.99. Okay, and then I picked up these little button gingerbread man buttons. And then I picked up these um, reindeer. They were $1.99. And then I picked up these little sleds. And so this is stuff that I can use, you know, this coming year. Um... Also, I picked up, now this is, I know this is 90% stuff, so I think all of that right there was probably 75% um, off stuff. These items I picked up 90%, so I paid 39 cents a piece for each of these. And I used these like in different projects and things like that, so when I saw that they had three up there at 39 cents, I grabbed them all. So I got those. And then I also, at 90%, I picked these up. I have been watching these um, during the holiday. These little um, snow boots. Um, and so I was like, I don't know. You know, and they were $15.99 with the 40% uh, off, I think. But when I went back for the 90%, they had them. So I paid $1.59 for these. I picked up. I picked up one okay and then I also picked up these these heart ornaments and they were $15.99 as well but I paid a dollar and 59 cent um, and these are hearts and these can be actually used for Valentine's or Christmas so I picked these up okay I also grabbed these right here let me just grab one okay and these were $6.99 the home collection and these are ornament hangers and um, of course I will use them for other things but um, at 59 cents um, what 69 cents 69 cents um, I just grabbed quite a few of them because like I said I do events and things like that um, for my women's group and so I can use these you know at some point so I'm trying to get them unhooked so at that price I grabbed six of them okay I apologize for the noise okay and I think I'm gonna let me clear my desk off some and then I'll come back Okay, now from Hobby Lobby, I picked up, this was part of the Valentine's, so the Valentine's things are 40% um, off right now, so I picked up this little box that I'm going to use in my event because I'm going to do, um, I'm going to do, um, what do you call it, um, like door prizes, 
So I'm going to have like the ladies put their names, drop them in the box, and then that's how we're going to do our door prizes. Um, and then I picked up these as well. These were $3.99 with 40% off. And um, so I just picked these up because I thought they were, they were cute. Um, and no specific reason. I just liked them. And at 40% off at $3.99, I just I grabbed those. Okay. I also picked up another book. And I got this book um, at the 75% off. And I'm glad I did because when I went, they had about six or seven of them. And I was like, maybe I should just wait until, you know, 90% off because nobody's really going to buy them. <laughs> How about when I went back, they were gone. They didn't have any more of these. They had another book, but it um, it was for it was for something else holiday. But anyway, um, so this was $17.99. So I paid maybe like $5 for it, which whoever picked it up at 90% off, they got it for $1.79. But I picked it up because I make the... Um, I make hot cocoa bombs occasionally and um, this says it has 75 fabulous cocoa truffle um, drinks in here so I thought I would get this just to kind of um, use it as inspiration the next time I do cocoa bombs so I picked that up I also picked up this little sign it was regular $11.99 but I got it for $2.99 and um, I just thought it was cute and it says if you need me I'll be in my she shed. I don't have a she shed, but I consider my craft room my she shed. So, <laughs> so I picked that up. Um, or should I say I don't have a she shed yet? <laughs> and I also picked up these um, beads right here. Um, when I got them, they were fifty percent off. So I paid what two fifty for these. And um, uh, it, it says two point one ounce. So they have like a marble look to them. So I picked those up. And then I picked up these butterflies. Because I thought they would be cute to use on, um, you know, different projects and things like that. I also picked up this little sign. And I just thought it was cute. It says create. And I think I'm going to put it on my, um, on my Cricut. I think I'm going to put this on my Cricut. I have something on my Cricut right now. A little, um, it's like the little um, hobo um, feathers I have on there. That I had from a sticker sticker packet that I have, but I'm, I think I'm going to take that off and I'm going to put this on there. That's my thought. That was my thought when I saw it was I can put that on my Cricut, and so I picked that up. And I think that was on sale. That was the when it was $9.99, but all the Paper Studio stuff was half off. I think so. I, that's why I got that too. And then I also picked up these right here, these Chanel stems, and I've been needing like the um the like the glitter the tinsel tinsel so I picked these up and these are um, like I said the red the glitter tinsel red so that's what I got there and then for my next bag I told you I have a lot of stuff to share so I'm trying to get through this really quick so that my video is not super long um, I also picked up another one um, like the little candy thing I showed you I got from Target well I picked up another one of another of the bubblegum machine machines and they were um, it was part of the Christmas so it was a dollar twenty nine it was regular um, twelve ninety nine but I got it at the ninety percent off and I should have grabbed two of them after I got it but it's okay because the the one I got it from was the one that was further away from me, and I'm not going back out there just for one of these. So anyway, I just picked up one because I do use them to, you know, to store, um, you know, craft supplies in, and with the glass part, you know, it just it looks pretty, and um, it gives your your craft space just you know a cute little um, something extra to see some of the things displayed. Okay, and then this is my last bag. And um, I really went to Hobby Lobby for the 90% off because I was looking for these. These candle holders. The, they're the pillar candle holders. And when I went, um, okay, it says they're $29.99. But when I went, they had like six or seven of them. 
And I promise y'all, I, I know I saw 42. I don't know if I picked up a different one. Um, but it had $42.99 on it. As you can see, this has $29.99. I would have bought all of them at the 75% off. But, like I said, I, I think I may have picked up a different one because it said $42.99. I'm thinking, okay, when they do the 90% off, I can get them for like $4.30. And so, my reasoning really going to the 90% um, off sale was to get all of them that they had left. How about when I went, they were all gone except this one. This one! And I found it on a top shelf. Um, and um, so anyway, I grabbed this one. And then I went to another Hobby Lobby. They didn't have any. Then I went to the Hobby Lobby that was further out and I found this one. So... Um, because I mean, had I had I seen these at twenty nine ninety nine at the seventy five percent off, I would have I would have went ahead and bought all of them. Um, but anyway, I got two. I found two, so that's good. And then I also when I went to the store that was further out for the ninety percent off, this one I paid two dollars and nineteen cents for it. Um. It was regular $21.99, which, which kind of confused me because, like, this is $21 and this is $29. Like, okay, $8 difference. But um, after I got it, I realized that it was, it's a little, it's like crooked. Like, it doesn't stand up straight. So, I don't know. I don't know if I'm going to keep it or if I'm going to take it back. But you can see right here where it's, it's not. You could tell at the bottom right here. See where it's bent, like bent. So I don't know. I don't know. I I may take it back because, yeah, I think I may take that back. Let me put that with the straws. <laughs> um. And then I picked up this right here. This I was eyeing during the um Christmas season, and this was twenty nine ninety nine. And I got it for two dollars and ninety nine cents um, with the ninety percent off. And I'm so glad I was able to get it at that price because when I first saw it, I was like, Nah, I don't want to pay thirty dollars for it. And then they did the um, what sixty percent off, I think. And then they went to the seventy five percent off, and then they went to the ninety percent. So I was able to find one at the ninety percent. And. Um, I also picked up these. Everything I'm getting ready to show you now was 90% off. Okay, so I paid 99 cents for these. And this is Robert Stanley Foam Glitter Snowflakes, the home collection. So um, I had to kind of go through and look through the bags because some of these, um, they were broken inside the bag. So this was like the best one I saw. I didn't see any broken in here. So I picked that one up. And then I also picked up this right here. I thought it was really cute. I've got to glue this this back on. It's, it's hanging by a glue thread. Well, I just pulled it off the glue thread. But um, it's like a stack of presents. So I got this. And um, this was $14.99. So I paid $1.49 for it. I mean, to get this stuff at 90% um, off is a steal. I mean, it is a steal. And then this, what is that? Oh, okay, my husband picked this up. He was with me um, when I went um, to one of the Hobby Lobbies, and he picked this up. He loves Polar Express. So um, this is a jigsaw puzzle, and it's uh, 550 pieces. It was he paid a dollar and twenty nine cent for it. It was regular um, twelve ninety nine. So he picked that up, and it says it comes with a bonus poster included. And let's see. Oh, I picked up these. I got a lot of these. I got six, and they were thirty nine cents a piece. Regular three ninety nine. And it says food safe, hand wash only. And they're just the little um, like cutting boards. 
and I got the ones that said Joy and Fala La and Noel. One says Noel. So I just picked up six of those because I thought, you know, I could personalize these or whatever and um, maybe do them as Christmas gifts. Um, I don't know. I just got them at 39 cents. You can't beat that. And then I picked up a larger one. It has a snowflake on it. And this was $3.49, so I paid $0.35 cents for it. Okay, and um, I'm almost at the end, y'all. And then I picked up this right here. This is also the Robert Stanley collection. And it's just a um, silk table runner. It says faux silk table runner and it was um i paid two dollars and 59 cent for it because it was regular 25.99 but i just thought it was really pretty they only had one up there so i grabbed it um at that price that was a good price and then last but not least i think yeah i picked up um three of these christmas vinyls and um, this one's removable, this one right here. Um, this one is iron-on, and then this one is a removable. As well, actually, these are the same. And these were a dollar nine cent. That's why I got them. Um, and then the the um, the iron-on was a dollar fifty-nine cent. Yeah. And I had already picked up, I think, two of these when they did the. Um, when they first, I think it was a 75% off, and I, I had picked up two already, so I just have those to have in my stash to do, like, little Christmas um, projects with. So, that is all um, that I have purchased. I appreciate you watching. If you have not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe to my channel. Um, let's see, do I have any special announcements? Um... Special announcements. Okay, so before the year ended, I had um, talked to you all about, you know, my Mixed Media Mondays. And I am going to start that back up. Um, but I just had to take a little break from YouTube for a minute um, to try to get some things done. And um, I am going to start back my Mixed Media Mondays. Um, but you know how it is. You know, we make plans, but God is the one that that orders our steps, you know, he's the one that that determines our steps. So, you know, even though I make plans to do things, you know, if God steps in and changes them, then then I have to go with the flow. <laughs> so, um anyway, um I do plan on um starting back my mixed media Mondays. Um it probably won't be this month, it may be next month because I still got some other things going on. Um and then my husband with his business um, you know, I'm working with him on some things with that. And then y'all know tax season is upon us. So we've got to start pulling tax stuff together. And it's just a lot, um, going on. Um, you know, we have to do the corporation stuff and all that. So it's just a lot going on right now. So I don't know, um, if I will be, I don't know what I'll be doing this month. I'm just going to kind of play it by ear. I'm not going to really say because I just don't know how things are going to, um, work out for January and February at that at, at that point um also I have an event coming up in March um that I'm also working on so I kind of got a lot going on right now but I will be coming back with a um video for you all here um probably maybe the I don't know probably the end of this month sometime um, like I said, I'm just going to play it by ear because I just, I can't really say right now because I just have so much going on. Usually the beginning of the year are my busy, are my busiest times of the year. And especially with my new business, you know, I also have to get my tax stuff together and all of that. Um, so it's just kind of a lot right now, but I will pop in with another video. It may be a haul, it may be a craft video. Or I might just decide to do something um, for Mixed Media Monday before the month is out. I'm just going to have to kind of see. Um, also, there is one other thing I wanted to... Gosh, what was it? I wanted to talk to you all about. Um, oh, my goodness. I should have written it down. See, this is what happens when I don't write it down. And I have my planner 
and um, I just still didn't write it down because I thought I would remember it. Um, let's see, what was it? Um, there's something I need to share with you all. Oh, 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 oh. I just looked around my craft, my craft room and it is a hot mess express. <laughs> Let me tell you. Um, coming off of Christmas, I still got some Christmas stuff I need to put away. Um, I put away like the main decorations in my house, but it's just stuff that I have here in my craft room that I need to put away. I'm also going through my dies and my stamps because I'm getting ready to do a, um, a garage sale or de-stash, whatever you want to call it. And I will be um, putting together some boxes of some things because I've got to, with my business, I've got to free up some more space here in my craft room because I have supplies that's coming in that I need for my business um, and I just need space. So I'm at a point now where I am, if I haven't used dies, dies and stamps within the last year, I know I'm probably not going to use them. There are some that I will be keeping because I'll be using, you know, for my own personal needs. But um, I have already gone through and pulled out some of my woodblock stamps. I have already started pulling out some dies. Some of the dies are brand new. I never used. And um, I purchased them when I had my, my previous business. But um, I know I'm not going to use it. So I'm just going to go ahead, do a de-stash. I will be selling these boxes at a really good price. Um... I mean, you'll be getting way more than what you, you know, are paying for. So I'm going to be putting those boxes together, but I'm still trying to clean stuff out and get, you know, dies out that I'm not going to use and, um, and just, you know, allow another crafter to purchase them at a discount price and be able to, you know, add them to your stash. So, um, I think that's it that's it for the special announcements so until my next video you all take care of yourselves and um, don't forget if you have not subscribed please go ahead and subscribe to my channel and don't forget to click on the notification bell um, so that you'll be notified every time I upload a video I want to say thank you to all of my new subscribers I appreciate you coming over and subscribing to my channel and as always to my veteran subscribers thank you so much for hanging in here with me even through all of my little changes and things like that I really appreciate you all um, you know remaining um, a support um, to my channel and um, with that being said I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna close this video and you all as always be blessed bye